Hello, and welcome to another video by ES Repair. I am your host, Mr. Fixit. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a Google Chromecast. Uh, this is similar to uh, the Fire Stick and the Roku. And what these do is they pretty much give you an ordinary HDMI TV or high definition TV and add some applications to it similar to what a smart TV is. Uh, the Chromecast in particular has YouTube app, Netflix, Hulu, Spotify, HBO, and so on. And there's quite a few that these can provide. Uh, you can also uh, cast your mobile devices, whether it's a tablet, a computer, or even a smartphone to these devices, and cast your videos, your movies, whatever you're watching on your device, over to your TV. And I'm going to show you every, how to set these up. They're fairly simple, and they're not hard to do. Uh, if you have an Android, an iOS device, um, this you can use them on this. Uh, if you have a computer or a laptop, um, you can use this too as well. And as I said, it turns any ordinary um, high definition TV into a smart TV. So let me go ahead and I will take this apart and show you everything that it comes with and then we'll begin to set it up. Now the first thing I'm going to do is take the packaging apart. And as you open up, there's the uh, device and we'll go ahead and open it up. Now the things that you should have is you should have the Google Chromecast uh, that you see here. Uh, this is a newer version. You've probably seen the ones before where they had the uh, look like a stick. Uh, this is the newer version and as you can see it does have a HDMI plug. So this will plug into your TV. It's also got a magnet clip uh, so when you're done with it you can just put it back together and that's all. Now you also have the getting started. Uh, this gives you uh, details as to how to set it up. As you can see it's fairly simple. You also have the USB plug. Now the USB plug is to give it power and you have two options. You can either use the AC plug that comes with it to provide power to the Chromecast. And as you'll see in this video, if your TV has a USB port, you can plug it into the USB port instead to power the Chromecast. So let's get started. Now as you can see, uh, this TV does have multiple ports and this one here in particular has four HDMI's and it does have a USB port so what you'll do is you'll go ahead and plug in the TV's uh, HDMI port that you see here into the port and as you can see it's got a magnet to it So you'll plug it in there as you see here. Now you'll take the other end uh, that you see and what this is is the plug-in. So we'll take the other end of the USB and plug it in. Uh, like you see here. Now we're going to plug the other end into the USB port because this TV has one. Now keep in mind if your TV does not have a USB port you can use the uh, the adapter that came with it and plug it into an AC outlet. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and plug it in and there you go. Now I've got both the uh, Chromecast and the power cord plug into the back of the TV now you need to make a note as to which one that this is plugged into. The HDMI, if it's got more than one, will have an identification so you'll know which one it is. 
Now we need to turn on the TV and I'll show you the next step. Now once you have everything plugged in, it's time to turn on the TV. Now as you can see, uh, I had the standard uh, cable TV on. What you want to do is on your TV, you want to change the source and you want to choose the source that your uh, TV is connected to. And as you can see here on the display, it showed that I was on HDMI 4 and that's the display that I want. Now the first thing that you see, you'll see the set me up. It's going to give you the website to go to, which is chromecast.com slash setup. And you're going to see that you can also do this on your mobile device. Now you also want to take a look in the lower left hand corner. Uh, this is going to give you an ID number that you'll need to have uh, to set up the device. So let's go ahead and set up the device. So the next thing we're going to do is on the device, we are going to go ahead and click the button. Now depending on which device you're using, uh, this will come out with an Apple Store or Google Play Store. Uh, I'm on an Android uh, phone, or uh, you can do this in Google Play for Android tablets, phones. Uh, iOS is Apple, so you'll have to go to the Apple Store for those. And I'm going to also show you how to do it on the computer. So what you'll want to do is go ahead and click Google Play. Now you may have to ask this, just go to the store. Now we are on the device and we're going to install. Now it's going to complete the account setup. Now this tells you everything, the permissions that it's going to use. Uh, you can skip it for now if you want, um, or you can continue. Uh, I'm just going to skip it for now. Uh, if you look through it, uh, this is for you know your payment options. So if you want to buy subscriptions, things like that, as I showed earlier, you can. Now these are the permissions that's going to be allowed uh, to use. Uh, the app, go ahead and accept, and then it's going to install. Now once it installs, go ahead and open. And now we're going to begin the setup. So now we're going to accept. Now it's going to look for the device. And as you can see, it had found the device. So we're going to continue. Now, as you can see, it popped up the name of the device. And now it's been connected to the Chromecast. Now, it's going to ask you for, to see the code. So what you'll do is look on the screen, you'll see the code, and then what you'll do is type yes, I see the code. Now here you can name the device. So any devices that's going to be using this, you can name it so it's easy to find, and then choose continue. Now want to know what the Wi-Fi password is. So you enter your Wi-Fi password. Now once you get the uh, the screen here, uh, once you get everything set up, there may be an update that has to install with your, your, with your Google Chromecast. Let it go ahead and install an update. And when everything's finished, you'll come to this screen, which lets you know that your TV and your Google Chromecast is now set up. Now, on, the, on your device, now you can go ahead and sign in. 
Now, once it's complete, uh, this will show you some tips and tricks uh, that you can use. Uh, you can also use an e uh, email notification to let you know about new offers and apps uh, and upcoming uh, updates. Just tap continue. Now it's going to show you the uh, the new best friend and this is going to be your Chromecast button. So what you want to do now is learn how to cast. And this shows you uh, different ways that you can use it. So you can choose your uh, tutorial. And this shows you how you can cast and you just follow the uh, prompts and this will show you how to cast. Now you can also uh, manage your music, you can listen to music, uh, you can watch movies, videos, um, doesn't matter. Uh, you can also manage your devices up here in the right hand corner. Now once everything's set up you can scroll through get the different apps you want. Uh, you can watch TV shows which is Netflix. You can also get NBA for Chromecast, uh, ABC, HBO Now, Sports, uh, Cable On Demand. There, there's all kinds of apps that you can get and um, I can show you how to, uh, an example as to how to use some of these apps. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to install my Netflix account or my app. And of course you're going to have the same uh, things that you had before. You'll have to accept your uh, things that the application needs to access. And then choose accept. And it's going to install the app. Now once it's uh, enabled and installed I'm going to open it. And now the app begins. Now we're going to set up the app. Now, once you have everything set up, uh, you will have to sign into your account or create an account. Uh, many of these do have subscription fees that you have to pay for every month. Uh, this one here is Netflix, as you can see. This is the app that I installed. And I went ahead and signed into my account so I can uh, watch it on my phone. Now the next thing you could do, uh, you could pick a movie or a show. And you can scroll down. Let me go ahead and pick this one. Now, as you can see here, it's playing the video, the movie. And what you'll do, you'll see this icon up here. And what this icon does is allows you to cast. Now, it's going to come onto the device. It's going to ask you which device to select. You select a device. And there you go. Now you're casting from the phone or your mobile device to your TV. And this is basically all you have to do. You can uh, play music, you can watch your TV shows, you can do Hulu, there's all kinds of things that you could do. And now you can cast from your device to your TV. Now, for what we're going to do here is we're going to show you how to do this on a computer. Uh, you can do it on Windows or Mac. Uh, I don't have a Mac with me right now, so I won't be able to show you how to do it on a Mac. But this should be the same. Now, what you'll do, in order for this to work to where you can cast over to your Chromecast, uh, you have to have uh, the Google Chrome browser. Uh, if you don't have it, you can download it from google.com forward slash chrome and that will give you to the download page. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and open chrome. Now once you're in chrome, uh, you can go to any website you want. 
there are some websites that can cast to Chromecast, um, but Google Chrome will work best because, believe it or not, it does have a built-in cast application. But you have to have the latest version. Um, if you're not sure which version you have, you can go up here to the upper right and click the three dots and then go down to um, settings and then go over here to the left and choose about and this will tell you what version you have uh, this one here that I have now is version 58 uh, you can also um, if you're not sure what you have you can go ahead and have it update the um, application now it should automatically update itself so what we'll do is I'll go to Netflix now that I'm on Netflix I can go ahead and sign into the account now once you're on a website now you can uh, access the uh, movies and shows that you want to watch and I'll go ahead and go back when I work for you on now you as you can see here the video is playing now let's say I want to go ahead and cast this to the Chromecast unit. What you'll do is go up here to the upper right, you'll click the three dots again, you'll see the menu come down, and what you want to do is go down here just under print and it says cast. Now you're going to get the menu up here, uh, it's going to tell you to uh, thank you for uh, getting the Chromecast, you'll notice that you'll see the name of your device that you named it. So what you'll do, go ahead and select it. And it will go to your Chromecast device. And there you have it. Now you can watch your uh, videos, your movies, onto your Chromecast. Now keep in mind uh, that you do have to have subscriptions for the apps that are built into the Chromecast. And keep in mind that some devices and some websites will require a PIN number. So it will show you on the TV uh, with the PIN number that you have to have to connect the device. Well, this concludes this video by ES Repair. I am your host, Mr. Fixit. Thank you for watching.